Welcome to the spoken tutorial of Opsim. In this tutorial, I'll be covering features of Opsim, how to get started with Opsim, and few examples to demonstrate design and analysis of optical link in Opsim. Opsim is a commercial software by Arsoft Design Group. It is a advanced optical communication system simulation package which is designed for professional engineering cutting edge research of WDM, DWDM, TDM, optical LAN, optical bus and other system in telecom application. Opsim has twin simulation engines that is it allows to design block mode and sample mode projects it has it helps to analyze the results and also supports post processing of the results the results can be signal wave plots such as eye diagrams bit error rate sp signal spectra frequency chip power and dispersion maps analysis of crosstalk jitter skew and others Opsim helps to design blocks in MATLAB and SPICE which can be interfaced with other inbuilt components of Opsim. It also supports interfacing of Opsim with some lab testing equipments. Now to get started with Opsim, the points that I'll be covering is to open Opsim window, to use Opsim window, to draw a link in Opsim and to do the analysis and see the results. The first thing is how to open a Opsim window. The Opsim icon is present either on the desktop, startup menu or you can go to the all programs, Arts of Photonic CAD suit and click on Opsim icon. It will open an Opsim window. Opsim window has following GUI module. First is title bar. At the top of the Opsim window, the title bar displays the project of currently open. Below title bar, menu bar groups most Opsim commands into window style pull down menus. Toolbar directly below the menu bar groups a set of buttons that serve as shortcut for most frequently used commands in the menu bar for editing related functions. The run menu bar is a set of shortcut buttons for simulation run related commands. The toolbox is another set of shortcut buttons to access tools that are used in schematic drawing. Explorer module provides access to the model library, models palettes, favorite schematic, user library, command component library and more. Design area is the area below the toolbar where you may create graphical network representing your design. Status bar at the bottom of the Opsim window is used to provide the status of the simulation. To open a new project, go to File, New, Schematic or you can directly click on sample mode project or block mode project here itself. If you click on schematic, create new schematic window opens where you have an option of selecting the model type that is sample mode or block mode. After selecting the model type, we have to enter the file name or the project name, press OK. It will ask you for simulation parameters. 
press ok it will open the project with the name entered now in the design area you can add the components before that to see all the pro components that are there in the opsim window press on all models it will expand the sample mode components to see what all components are available for designing an op sim the model palettes can also be clicked to see all the components in their symbolic representation you can select any component from the window and click on it and can drag it to the design area remember block mode components cannot be dragged into sample mode design area and vice versa to make the connection keep in mind blue terminal represents electrical signal red terminal represents optical signal and green terminal represents logical signal blue can be connected to blue terminal red can be connected to red terminal and only green terminal can be connected to blue you can use shortcuts such as control c and control v to copy and paste any component before simulating we have to do two things first we have to set properties of all components as per the design requirements to set the values double click on component properties window will open set the values of various parameters in the properties window and press okay it should be done for all the components before simulation the second important thing is to save the project to save the project click on save icon opsim file is saved with .moml extension to simulate the link click on go in the run toolbar it will open simulation run dialog box and click on single start single run execution will start after execution is over it will display success if execution success status if execution time is less than 7 second that means the project has not been executed fully scroll the window to detect if errors have occurred while execution and then rectify it and re-simulate it to see the output waveform right click on scope to select type of waveform required as output after selecting after selecting the type of signal opsim data display along with the waveform request is open all of the signal waveforms can be directly selected from opsim data display window the parameters like ber quality factor eye opening jitter can be easily calculated by selecting these icon in data display windows the expected outcome from this tutorial is you should be able to find out or you are able to kn you know the features of opsim you know to start an opsim and you know to simulate a simple example in opsim thank you